The Ave of ICP is coming your way soon with DeFinance. Today, I'm going to be talking about a new DeFi project that's coming to the ICP ecosystem. And it's basically the Ave of ICP with some ICP twists to make it even better than what Ave does. All right, cool. Now let's get into it. Um, and before I start this video, I want to make it very clear. I did join the team over at DeFinance. So, yeah. Now, take a look at this. I think a lot of you guys are you know, familiar with Aave. Aave is a borrowing and lending platform on Ethereum and it's hyper successful. And right now DeFi on ICP is currently being built out and DeFinance is basically going to be the Aave of ICP, which is really, really bullish. And we're going to get into why and all that stuff in case you don't know Aave is and all that. So take a look at this. We're on the DeFinance website. It says lend, borrow, earn, revolutionize DeFi on the internet computer. So I'm just going to be, you know, going over some of the key features and all the other cool stuff. But let's just start with, you know, kind of the, the initial pitch. DeFinance is an innovative lending and borrowing platform on the Internet Computer Protocol, revolution, revolutionizing DeFi with a unique liquidation model and buy and burn mechanism that ensure deflationary stability and continuous value appreciation. Once the token goes live, leveraging ICP secure architecture, DeFinance operates without a traditional safety module, providing reliable and efficient financial ecosystem for users jesus christ i'm having such a tough time reading it's early but um now let's take a look at some of the key features so i did initially you know i'm saying because um when you're pitching something you can't just you know go into all the unique features i think it's just easier to pitch this as the ave of icp if i'm talking to someone in solana i'm talking to someone ethereum and i'm trying to get that little elevator pitch going i'm gonna say it's the ave of icp done they already know what it is ave of icp and they ask some more questions hey you know, there's some other cool key features, but now we're going to talk about the key features, which actually makes it special. And it's because of the internet computer. So our key features from initial lending to rewarding token growth, DeFinance unlocks new dimensions in DeFi. So lending and borrowing engage with our platform from day one, simply lend or borrow and provide liquidity to be rewarded. Early users will earn DeFinance token post launch. Hmm. Could be an opportunity there for some of you guys buy and burn mechanism. Benefit from our distinctive buy and burn mechanism that enhances token value by systematically reducing supply. As you earn DeFinance tokens, this deflationary strategy will continuously work to increase their long-term worth. And I'm pretty sure that Aave does not have a buy burn mechanism. And I don't think any borrowing lending platform in crypto has it. Could be wrong though. Earn with rewards. Prepare to earn impressive yields once our DeFinance tokens are distributed by actively participating in lending and borrowing and liquidity provision. You'll gain access to exclusive rewards that amplify your financial growth on our platform. Launchpad access. Be first in line for the next big ICP breakthrough projects. There's going to be a launchpad. Now, let's take a look at this. Liquidity made easy. From launch, users can fuel our platform by providing liquidity using ICP, along with major cryptocurrencies like BTC and ETH. As we launch, expect to see significant integrations within the ICP ecosystem, such as the addition of stable coins, which I'm going to talk about a little later in the video, and connections to other major blockchains. Cool. So I think you guys kind of get the gist of it. I think I'll make more videos in the future. Well, I will be making more videos in the future, going over more of the nitty gritty on what makes DeFinance so special. But for this, I kind of just wanted to be an introduction video to, you know, explain to you guys just, hey, this thing actually exists and it's being built. Um, but now let's talk about the market opportunity, okay? Because most of you guys are watching this video, you're probably trying to know, well, how the fuck am I going to make some money off this? Now, you can obviously use the platform to make money, but now let's talk about the market opportunity that DeFinance is going to actually capture. So we're going to go to DeFi Llama and right now we are looking at Ethereum. So right now Ethereum has a total value locked of $58 billion. It's a lot of money. And if we go down and we take a look at the third project that's providing that TVL, we can see it's Aave. Hmm. And DeFinance is the Aave of ICP. Right now Aave is a TVL of $10 billion and Aave's token is currently by market cap the 64th largest token in all of crypto with a $1.2 billion market cap. And as you can see last cycle, it had an impressive run, basically just kind of stayed flat. And then when we had that big up only moment in 2021 in Q1 and Q2, it absolutely ran. And at the peak of, you know, that first run up that Bitcoin had in 2021, Aave reached a price of $500. Um, let's go to market cap actually. The market cap reached around $7 billion. So this thing is an absolute 
monster. Now, of course, we know that Ethereum has, you know, the first mover advantage. It's a much bigger chain of many more users. But I'm just trying to show you the, you know, potential of Definance. But now let's go to ICP. So as we go to ICP, all right, you can see we have a TVL of $70 million, which is really, really low. <clears throat> Currently, ICP's uh, total market cap is sitting around three, four billion dollars, and our TVL is seventy million dollars. Now, yes, you're right. That's really fucking low TVL. But what that means is that there is a huge market opportunity. And as we go down here, you're going to see something. And guess what? We don't have here. We do not have a borrowing and lending platform. So. What that means is DeFinance is going to be able to step in and grab a lot of that liquidity and a lot of the TVL in the ICP ecosystem. As we know, ICP, there's a ton of people who have their, you know, their ICP staked, and that's going to create a big opportunity when it comes to liquid staking and also the borrowing and lending and how, you know, DeFinance could potentially work with some of these liquid staking platforms to make a lot of cool stuff happen. Okay. So ICP DeFi as a whole right now is, you know, being built out. We're basically in the early, the, you know, pretty early stages of it. And what that means is once ICP DeFi actually has, you know, robust platforms, we're going to be capturing a lot of the TVL. Um, and I think most of the TVL and ICP is going to end up, well, we've seen this on Ethereum and Solana. You can kind of use those two chains as your proof of concept, but most of the TVL, basically all of it is going to go to DeFi. And a borrowing and lending platform, as we've seen on Ethereum and Solana, is one of the top, top, you know, garners of that TVL. So if you just look at what's going on Ethereum and Solana, you can see that, hey, a borrowing and lending platform has that proof of concept and it does work. And on top of that, because of the capabilities of the internet computer, and in this, in another video, I will go into, you know, the nitty gritty of DeFinance and everything. Um, but, you know, you'll see. So let's talk about, you know, just price action. So as you can see here, once again, I just showed off the Aave chart. Basically what I'm trying to say is you're fucking early if you're watching this video, okay? The TVL on ICP is low. We have a pretty high market cap, three, $4 billion. And I think ICP can do very well this cycle. I think $100 is very, very possible. Obviously, you know, who knows what the hell can happen? We don't know. But I think ICP can definitely hit $100 a cycle. And with the TVL being so low, this provides an awesome opportunity in the market for DeFinance to step in and do all that. So you can make a lot of money, potentially, you know, investing in some DeFinance stuff and playing around. Obviously, you know, not financial advice, of course, because everything in crypto, you know, you know how it is. But anyways, but now actually I want to talk on a couple of things. I make my videos, you know, no script and everything, but... Another thing I want to talk about is introduction of stable coins. So stable coins are coming to IC. Another part of the reason why our DeFi has not been really that good yet until like it's getting a lot better now is because we had no stable coins on ICP, but now we are getting stable coins. So it's going to allow people to trade a lot easier. And when people come to our chain in the future, they're going to be able to say, Hey, we have a borrowing lending platform. We have liquid staking. We have a good DEX and a bunch of other shit too which is super, super, super bullish because DeFi is really important. When you talk about what actually runs crypto, objectively speaking, DeFi is all the TVL. DeFi is all the money, okay? The meme coins do really well, but when it comes to actual usage on applications and platforms, it's literally all DeFi. That's it. Um, so it's very, very important because it actually, and we've seen this play out. When you talk about ICP's ecosystem, when it gets bigger, if you're watching this video right now, you're probably a niche ICP guy. But when the community gets bigger, you're going to be seeing people from Ethereum and Solana rolling in. If you want to know what the future of ICP looks like, just look to Ethereum and Solana because it's we're not playing in this nitty gritty game of a thousand people or 2000 people. We're trying to capture the broader market. Solana and Ethereum have captured, almost captured, especially Solana. Solana's doing super well, the broader market. So if you want to look at what happens when more people show up, look at Solana Ethereum and it's DeFi meme coins. So pretty much it's very bullish for DeFinance because it's a DeFi product. It's the Aave of ICP, which means it's going to be able to capture a lot of that TVL on ICP. And it's also something that has shown, um, fuck, what is it? Proof of concept. So that's pretty much it. Um, I think I hit most of the main points in this video. In another video, I'm going to go over the nitty nitty gritty. But in this video, I kind of just want to give an overview and introduction to DeFinance because I think it's going to be playing a very large future. Um, 
playing a very large role in the future of ICP. And it's going to be really cool to see how the ICP tech can be leveraged to do some awesome DeFi. And also go follow the Twitter, dfinance underscore app. It's pretty like inactive right now, but we're going to start getting more active on it and stuff. And also go follow me on X, Aaron Bremser underscore. And always, as you guys probably know, I run the most active group chat on ICP. So join my Telegram, my ICP Telegram link in the description. And yeah, thank you for watching.